Hey guys, today I'm reviewing a Keisha Hot Slim Cream. So I gave this cellulite product a one out of five stars. So <laughs> this is another Amazon fail. Um, oh, this product. So it has like a ton of um, like five star reviews, glowing, you know, results and all the things. And then when you weed through it, actually find like the ones that seem like honest reviews are one and two stars. People are having a really big issue with them, bad reactions um, or just no help whatsoever. And I fall into that category as well. Um, and something I found very fishy and kind of weird was that um, Akeisha no longer sells this on like their Amazon store. Um, but then two other brands or companies sell them. And like the old Akeisha product website or whatever it is on Amazon, they're selling it for like $66 or something ridiculous. Like, please do not spend that much money on that. Please don't just buy it at all. Like, I don't think it's a good product. But the other two places that they're selling these, um, one actually said that um, it was discon discontinued um, by the manufacturer. And I have a sneaky suspicion that there might be some that are expired or old or some quality control issues um, because I had some weird experiences with this one. So I bought it on Amazon for $12.99. You actually get a two pack and each of these are two ounces. So you get a total of four ounces. The bottles are not very big, um, but it works out to be about $3.25 an ounce, which is very cheap, very inexpensive, and you basically get what you pay for. Um, with this one and for the texture and feel, let me show you guys what these little things look like. So the texture and feel, so here's the little bottle. Again, it's very small. It is a white creamy lotion and there it is pretty basic. It does feel nice on the skin, um, but make sure you are um, washing your hands immediately after rubbing it in. Um, I'll kind of show you guys how it kind of rubs in. Um, so yes, yeah, so make sure you wash your hands. Don't touch your face. Don't touch anything precious because this has some very irritating ingredients in it. And for the application, let me try and wipe up really quick because this is a hot cream. So it's going to start burning in just a few minutes. So the application process is rather annoying. <laughs> so you're supposed to, um, put it on before working out and it's heat activated. And I did learn from other seemingly honest reviews on Amazon, don't put it on right after showering. Wait at least 10 minutes. I guess it makes everything just way more intense and bad things <laughs> happening. Um, so it says to, let me see what they actually say. Um, so it says before exercise, apply an ample amount um, and then coating all desired areas while massaging and it says the heat uh, the cream is activated by your elevated heart rate and works best during cardio circuit and high interval training. Um, so you put it on and in about three to four minutes, it starts to heat up and um, it lasts for about 45 minutes to an hour when you're working out and then does say to towel off um, before you shower. So you have to rinse it off. And then it also says, I don't know if I said this yet, but um, you have to wear loose and breathable clothing because like the friction on it is not good. And this is, it's just very weird because sometimes I would use it and I would, nothing would happen. Like I would work out and it's not heating up. It's not doing its job. And then other times, um, it would, it never like burned like some where I feel like it's lava on your skin, but it definitely heats up. And then a lot of maybe half the time I would get kind of like a red rash. I do have very sensitive skin, but it wasn't every time. So I just am so confused why that was happening. And then other, I saw a ton of other people that did have really bad reactions. They had to go rinse it off like basically after a few minutes, which I've definitely been there. So this one never was that hot for me. I have tried like hundreds of these, those hundreds of these though. So like I've kind of experienced it all, but it definitely does heat up. Um, but it just can be, it's just a wild card. And for the drying time, it dries in about, I would say two minutes. 
but it stays sticky on your skin, which you guys know is my pet peeve. I don't like that, especially if you're trying to work out and you're just hot and sticky and it's making you burn and it's just kind of a hot mess, literally. And the <laughs> smell, I need to figure out what it is exactly, but it smells awful and it's that, I don't know why I compare it to that, but it smells like baby formula to me. Like baby formula, it's like gone bad. So not a good smell, not a fan of that. And for the results, no results. I feel like half the time it just made my skin way more irritated. Like it's just basically a lotion. It does have some pretty good ingredients in it, um, but just, it was a total mess. I feel like if anything, it's just, an irritating basic lotion. Um, and again, I just think that it, there's just something going on with like the quality control. Like I looked at both of mine and they don't expire till uh, 2023, but there's just so many weird things. And also just don't trust these glowing five-star reviews on Amazon. Do your research, check all the, you know, the good and bad and the ugly, try and use resources like me or people that actually try them out um, and do their um, research and things like that. But I gave this one out of five stars. Just pass on it, guys. Don't, don't get this headache. And if you have any other um, cellulite products you want me to try, just drop them in a comment below and I'll test them out. If you'd like some more information, you can visit us on cellulite.com or on Facebook and Twitter.